Grains of sand drip tie from the pit where we once played. Memories of our incandescent conception, glory days lost in the haze as we grew. We were innocent back then, knotted together in tangled curls as we kissed on the floor at Hannah's house, eyes squeezed, tightly unaware of all we'd share in years to come. We played at the foot of the babbled brook, dabbled with the devil and spun many a bottle. Laughter reigned in childhood's gain as we ran free amidst the breeze. But new experiences formed our adolescence, away from the incandescence we once shone. Attentions turned, out of sight, but never truly out of mind. It was time to become the becoming of ourselves, travels and adventure delved upon to broaden the horizons away from the parapet. But destiny's desire took our hand and Sam became our playground once more. Roots of our foundation, cemented to the floor. It was a sweeter innocence to be felt as we melted together that first time. Years in wait of a moment that stole a tear from my eye. But self-harm and destruction took over. Amidst the hazy days of class A's and smoke-filled glaze to blind us toward the forked path. Neither of us could admit we were on, innocence gone. Yet friendship remained through faded passion. Security took for granted as seeds were planted in the gardens of others. And then love became duty, in the irony of the ringing steeple bells. So once a cherished thought, now fraught with doubt of a fraudulent existence for whom the bells toll. The bells stopped, the hourglass turned, tangled curls to be severed from the dreadlock that had formed, best friends torn apart, heaviness felt of broken hearts. We were comforted in arms outside the familiar, still magnetised by friendship as the years drifted by and the tears began to dry. They were sometimes a question mark, not a threat, always nostalgia, but never regret. And now the steeple bells ring out once more, new conceptions, happier directions, not quite strangers, not quite friends, but eternal bonds and broken, no requisite to be spoken. So as sands of a quarter century past, the last grains drain the residual sound of childhood. Beauty bound in letting go. Peace found. We lost our innocence, but found ourselves. And the memories of our glory days remains buried. A treasure of time, ingrained in sand, from the pit where we once played.